Okay, Jerry here, Kill Media, Bellator, two to seven, Bellator Dublin Media Day, and I'm here with Superwoman. <laughs> Superwoman. So uh, just just describe for people who don't know, describe a typical training day and home day altogether. Oh, but I'm gonna get tired even talking about it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I get up with Isabella, leave her to school. I go and do my run before training, but I have to do my run and drive to Dublin train. Half eleven, about half one in Dublin. Drive back up, pick Isabel up at three, get her homework, get her schoolwork done, then go out that night, coach, and get my second session. So how are you looking so like energetic? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just used to. I think I've just lost my mind and running on that energy. <laughs> yeah, just going to autopilot. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And do it. So um, you're you're a favourite daughter of Bellator, if you'd like. Um, Am I? <laughs> No, no, I mean, not that you don't deserve it, but like the, the, the promotion are clearly um, working with you, developing you, and they'll do that side, you must do the fighting side, yeah. so up on the main card now, not that you don't deserve it, but I mean, is it, it's all going to plan, it's all going well. Well, I've only had one fight, so yeah, it went well, um, I'm just focusing on improving in between fights and getting better and mm. hopefully bringing more skills to the, to the cage every time I fight. No, the reason I said that about Bellator, uh, um, you know, promoting is that, you know, if you remember the, the first visit to Dublin and there was a lot of discussion about, um, you know, Paul Redman up in the main card. Uh, oh, yeah. And David Green was saying, you know, well, if lots of other people could be on the main card. And of course, Liam McCourt was one of those mentioned. <laughs> so, so so here you are now and um, I mean, it's a big opportunity. And how's, how's it going to go? I mean, are you calm about it? Or are you? Yeah, I think this is the calmest I've ever felt. Like, I've done all the work. I've cried and bled and trained as hard as I can. And, uh, do you know, I've put the sweat and everything into it. And uh, everything I can do, I've done. And I just want to go in, enjoy this experience, enjoy fight night, and just keep calm and just do what I do and do me. And I, that's, that's whenever I'm best. Yeah. So you, you... You fought, you, you faced many high-level fighters, but I mean, the word is this is, you know, carries perhaps a step up a little bit, but I mean, but having said that, you were dominant the last time anyway, so I mean, you know, you've no fears in there on Friday night. Like, everybody has uh, nerves and uh, things to, to focus on their opponents. I think she's she's tough, she's gritty, she's um, aggressive, she can be aggressive in her strikes, she's experienced, she knows, um, you know, like, positioning wise, what way, you know, to, to, to defend herself, she's going to bring a good test for me on Friday, so I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and outside the cage as well, I've noticed you're getting a little bit more active, um, you're getting involved in a few promotions, modelling. Um, I'm not. <laughs> you are. I'm not doing any modelling. <laughs> if you appear in an ad and you're there, that's all oh, right. Okay. Yeah. But 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 that's a good side as well. I mean that that led to your value and to your commerciality. So I mean, does that kind of happen accidentally, or is it kind of by or, I don't or is it just working with sponsors basically? Yeah, yeah, working with sponsors, people that are support my career a lot at the time. It's working with sponsors and then. Um, any kind of work I get done, I just do it, yeah. yeah. And you were, you were becoming a fan <laughs> favourite very much so as well, North and This South is all right? new to me. <laughs> <laughs> But I think the secret is just do what you're doing, do it well. Uh, you know, let people know what you're doing in social media, which you do a bit. Yeah. But don't start promoting yourself. Yeah. Just just let your your actions promote you, and it's working. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. So really, look, hope you get uh, the win on Friday night, or Thanks. at least you know a great performance. And uh, and again, like a huge card, it's going to be a full tree arena. Yeah. Some people are posting that it's a sellout. I think there's a few tickets left on yeah. Ticketmaster, actually, guys. If you want to buy, it, there's a few tickets left. Yeah. But uh, it's tough. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> but, I mean, but that last time, I mean, that huge crowd, how did that affect you? Was it your first time in front of such a huge crowd? Um, no, I've fought bigger arenas before. And, and I, I kind of... Oh, I, yeah, this is it's normal for me. No, not normal. It's <laughs> kind know. of, I've always had that intense, like, pressure, no matter yeah. any fight I've had. I've kind of had, like, a baptism of fire in my, in my career. I'm always thrown in against... Do you like good tough opponents in big arenas, big promotions, and it's kind of what I'm used to. And I just kind of have to deal with all that that energy, the nerves, and just put it towards focusing on the fight. So you're in a good place. Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah, I feel think good. So I'm well. calm. Okay. So, so listen, best of luck on Thanks Friday, so and uh, we'll be there hopefully. Catch some some nice pictures. For okay. You as well. yeah. Thank you, Liam. Thanks. Very clear. Bye bye.